Right, so, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with another haul. We're filming an ASOS haul, now I feel like I haven't done ASOS in so long, but I kind of wanted to get like in the festive spirit. We've got some party, well when I say some, we've got one party dress, but you know, we're venturing out a little bit. I've got Christmas jumper, I've got some nice pieces, basically nice winter pieces that I think will be good for going out, staying in, chilling, being warm, being covered. And you'll get that joke in a minute when I show you what I've got. But yeah, I feel like ASOS is quite hard to shop on. I don't really shop on ASOS because I know it's so good that there's so many things on there. But I find it really difficult to find what I want because there is so much on there. So, like I said, I have an array of different things. Some accessories, just some normal clothing as well. So I think we should just get straight into the video. If you, if you are new to my channel, then please don't forget to subscribe down below. And follow me on Instagram, which will be in the description box down below. And yeah, let's just get into the haul. I'm going to try on the stuff for you guys so you can see what it looks like on. There's nothing much more to say, to be honest. So yeah, let's get going. Right, so I think I'm going to start off with the item that I've actually worn already because I've had this stuff a couple of weeks and I have already filmed this haul before, but I accidentally deleted the clips. So we're back to square one. <laughs> Here we are again. Sorry, this is a little bit of a delayed haul. But first of all, we have this misguided jumper. So I did wear it and clearly I forgot to take the tag out because I still got the tag in. But it's this really nice like ice blue jumper. It gives me winter vibes. Like I think this would look so nice if you were going skiing. It just gives me nice like snow icy vibes. I don't know what it is. It just, I love it. I love the color. It's a really thick knit. It's really nice. Yeah. It's just a really nice jumper. It's from Misguided, like I said. Um, and yeah, it's kind of like a bat wing. I love it, I love the color. I think it looks very flattering on. So yeah, you'll see how it looks in the try on. I already know what it looks like on, because like I said, I've already worn it. So this is what the Misguided jumper looks like on. I'm literally just obsessed with this. This is live in a jumper. I just love baggy jumpers that you can just throw on that look nice, that don't look too unflattering. You look cozy, you look warm. This is just me for the rest of the season. And that's me done. I have just got blue denim jeans on, but I think this would look better with leather trousers. But I love this, it's so cute. The neck's not too high. Um, it's comfy, it's cozy, and I love the sleeves being so baggy and just exactly what I'm looking for this time of year. I love it. So next up we have a little party season kind of dress. I feel like this one is perfect for this time of year because of the colours. I feel like they're such festive colours and I think it would be perfect for like a Christmas party, things like that if you've got one coming up, Christmas Eve or even Christmas Day. I don't know about you guys. I used to, like I've never been a family that would stay in their pyjamas. We would get dressed with like the stuff that we got on Christmas Day. But I know some families would like get dressy and I feel like this is a really nice dress to wear. This for me is something that I would probably opt for just because it's not really like revealing. It's comfy, it's a nice material, it's a nice style. I love this like square neck sort of style with the um, ruching. That's just my favorite kind of style at the moment. So yeah, I think this would look really, really nice on. I'm excited to try it to be honest. It's from the bat brand St. Ginny's. St. Ginez? I don't really know, I've never heard of it. But I got it in a size 10 and I just think it's a really cute little dress for this time of year. Okay, you guys, I love this dress. This is so perfect. If I was going out anywhere or going to some sort of like Christmas party, this would be something that I would wear. It's really, really flattering. It's really comfortable. It's like baggy around your belly so you can eat all the Christmas dinners you want. But it's fitted around this area because it's got a corset detail. And it's kind of got like a cup shape here around the booze, which is really flattering. This neckline I think is really flattering in general. And I love this pattern and the frilly sleeves. I just think this is a beautiful dress for this time of year. And you're not going to get too cold. You're not fully on show. You've got sleeves. Yeah, I love this. I think this would definitely be something I would wear if I was going out. So yeah, this definitely, this could possibly be my favorite thing I've picked up in this whole haul. I think it's so nice. I love green at the moment. I think it's such a festive color. And yeah, cute. So next up we have some nipple covers. So this is what I meant when I said I've got things to cover. Um, I always, I'm looking for these. I always need them. Well, I mean, <laughs> I don't ever go out, but when I do go out, I just quite like to use, I would rather use nipple covers than when I used to go out back in the day, I did always need these. So these are actually really, really handy if you do go out and stuff for when you're wearing like lace bodysuits and things like that. Bralettes, these are just perfect to put on your nipples. These are just really handy to have in your wardrobe and I'm gonna stop wobbling about a nipple cover. 
but yeah they're really handy and obviously they're not like shaped like a flower so you won't be able to see them i remember i had this like light blue bodysuit that i wore probably about four years ago and it was like a um a v-neck one and i had flowers like the nipple covers that had flowers on and you could see like i had flowers through the bodysuit so that was not a cute look so, so yeah i think they're a better more natural idea kind of vibe i think they could be good for like bodysuits if you don't like to wear bras and stuff anyway because who likes to wear bras certainly not me so next up we have this bodysuit from asos now the nipple covers could come in handy with this but this was actually really expensive i think it was about 30 something pounds just for a bodysuit but the quality of this bodysuit is really really good it's really thick it's kind of like bandage material but it's not like really tight it's like really quite stretchy i think this would look really really nice with some denim jeans or literally anything this can go with anything leather trousers so yeah i just think it's perfect and i like these kind of bodysuits that have long sleeves because i prefer that and they're better for the winter anyway so yeah i think this is going to look really flattering on and it's like a solid white it's not like a sheer white you know you buy like white bodysuits or tops and they're like kind of see-through i think this is going to look really nice on and i don't know if you can tell but it is like ribbed which is why i said it's kind of like bandage material because it is kind of yeah it's a lot more stretchy though a lot more give to it than bandage so i've got this bodysuit on i do have nipple covers on but they just look even worse and also on both boobs where like the stitching is it's kind of like separated which is just weird because it was so expensive for what it was uh this is definitely going back it's not worth the 30 something pounds i paid for it um and i didn't think it was gonna be see-through but i've got nipple covers on and you can see the nipple covers through the top which is just not a look <laughs> definitely not a look so next up we have this turtleneck i feel like you can't go wrong with turtlenecks everybody needs these in their wardrobe i've got a black one i feel like i need a white one although that would probably be an awful idea with my makeup but i always wear this sort of color and i think this would look really cute with black leather trousers which are always my go-to which is why i always say things are going to look good with that because that's literally what i wear but again with jeans skirts skirts and like tights and boots would look really really cute with this they're just so good to have in your wardrobe this time of year so easy to throw on and they're obviously good for layering as well if you're going like skiing or stuff i know it's not like a proper base layer but yeah they're good for layering too i think these look really really cute under sweatshirts like this like these colors together would look really cute i love the look of a turtleneck under a sweatshirt this sweatshirt by the way is coming up in a future haul so stay tuned for that won't be too long away i promise so this is what the turtleneck looks like on i really really like this to be honest they're just so easy to throw on and with jeans like this leather trousers as i said in the other clip it's just an easy way to go and i love nude like honestly nudes and neutrals are just my favorite way to go see i love this i think it's so cute and it's just an easy staple to have in your wardrobe that aren't too expensive and just look quite good with everything they look like you've made a little bit of an effort and i feel like they're quite like wintry and nice and warm so next up i picked up this now i don't know if this is going to be my cup of tea i don't know if i like the color but i saw this on the model and i thought it looked really cute so it's this top from misguided and it's just like a belted knitted top that i think I don't know it could be quite flattering quite a nice piece for this time of year to go out for like dinner cocktails just to chill in i just think it's quite a nice thing to have in your wardrobe because it's in between it's kind of like that jeans and a nice top look without being like too dressy i don't know if i'm gonna like it i'll see what it looks like on but again i think this would look really cute with leather trousers or i'm picturing these denim jeans that i've got recently from pretty little thing excuse me so yeah, again, we'll have to see what it looks like on. I did pick up everything in the size 10, I believe. I'll let you know if there's anything different. But yeah, I think that's all the sizing. Okay, I'm just going to cover my nipples right now because I haven't got a bra on. But this top is not what I was expecting. Uh, this looks like a mum top. It did not look like a mum top on the model. And also, there's nowhere to put the excess roping that you pull to make it tight around your waist so that's cute uh, so the next item is super exciting of course it's the season for christmas jumpers i like to have a christmas jumper for christmas day so i picked up this one because i thought it was super cute i don't know it kind of just gives me vintage vibes it's actually from the men's section but i got it in a size small um but it's still like oversized for me which i love i love this it's not too in your face but it's got some nice cool colors on it I just think it's super cute. I feel like you have to get a new Christmas jumper every year. There's no point wearing the same one you did last year. Like, it's a new Christmas, you need a new jumper. And I feel like, because this is, I know this is a Christmas jumper, but it doesn't say like, Merry Christmas, you filthy animal all over it, if you know what I mean. 
with like jingle bells and things like that all over it so yeah i think this one's a super cute item and i love this christmas jumper it's just super cute don't know what else to say about it but you can decide for yourself whether you like this one i feel like ugly christmas jumpers are the way to go and yeah like i said it gives me like vintage vibes which i think is nice i like that it's a bit different now this is a vibe i love this christmas jumper literally Literally, this could be my favourite Christmas jumper today. I obviously wouldn't wear it with blue jeans because it's just a bit blue. But I think with leather trousers, this would look super, super cute. And it's nice and festive. It gets me excited for Christmas. We've only got a few more days left now, which is just mad. But yeah, I like this. But again, I feel like this with a turtle... Right, okay. I've got a vision. This with the turtleneck underneath, it gives me like ultimate Christmas movie vibes. And the ski slopes with hats, gloves, scarves. I don't know. That is cute. I wish I had a white one. I don't have a white one, but I have got a black one and that could look quite cute too. So next up, I picked up this little hair bow, which I think would look so cute on Christmas day. And well, my vision is to wear it in like a low ponytail. Shall I try and do it now? I don't know if it's right. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's right, but if it is, I think that just looks super cute. Super easy way to wear your hair on Christmas day. So your face, you're looking festive. You're looking like a Christmas present. I just think it's so nice. I mean, you can wear it obviously not just on Christmas. I think they're a really nice like, winter accessory anyway. I love that. I didn't actually think I was going to like it that much, but I actually think that's really, really cute. I might wear my hair like this more often. That is so easy to just do. <laughs> that is super cute. I love that. Yay. So next up, we have a beanie. And this one's from Topshop. I think this is a super cute beanie, actually. I liked the black and white contrast, like the monochrome. I think this would look super nice on. The only thing about these coloured hats is that obviously most girls wear makeup. So makeup gets literally all over the hat. But I'm not being funny, it happens to the black ones as well. So you can't really win in that situation. But if you want to stay warm. Oh. Crikey. Whoa. Why is that so tight? I have not even, I've got a, such a pea head, so God knows why that's so freaking tight. Okay, avoid if you have big head. Avoid if you have a big head. What is that all about? I don't think I'm going to keep that just because it's so tight on my head. Is there different sizes it comes in? No, one size. Okay, so this next item I picked up, I thought were like nude leather trousers. I searched in the search bar on Google, like a crew leather trousers. And I saw this photo and it was on ASOS and obviously I was doing an ASOS shop. So I thought, oh, perfect. These are not a crew leather trousers. To be fair, I can see why I thought they were. I didn't read the description, um, but they're actually like a material. Um, so I don't think I'm gonna keep these because I'm not actually too keen on them. I mean, they're actually quite cute to be fair. They're actually quite nice. But I have really nowhere to wear these. But I'm not going to be keeping these because, like I said, they are not what I expected. So I did also order some from Zara. And they're a lot nicer. So I'm going to keep them ones instead. So I've got the trousers on. But I don't think you're going to be able to see them here. So I might just show you in the mirror behind me. Because otherwise you won't be able to see like the whole length and stuff like that. So yeah, I'll do that. So I thought this could possibly be a better way to show you the trousers. Obviously they're quite nice. But I'm not keeping them. They're not for me. They kind of remind me of like horse riding trousers. <laughs> but to be fair, like I said, if you have an office job or anything like that, or you like to dress like smart casual, I think these are really nice. They're really comfortable. But yeah, just not for me. And then finally, I've kind of been stepping out my comfort zone in this haul a little bit, like with that misguided jumper, tie up top, that green dress. It's just something that I wouldn't normally wear. The bow is something I wouldn't normally wear. So again, from misguided, I picked up this dress. Now I don't know if I'm gonna like this. <laughs> It looked really cute on the model and I love like this puff sleeve style as I said but I thought this could be like a really nice outfit just to wear casually with boots with trainers with knee-high boots like I just think it's a really nice winter piece to have without it being like trousers and stuff obviously it's a bit chilly but if you're going out in the evening for dinner or something like that where you are going to be indoors anyway it doesn't really matter I, I just think this is a super cute outfit like something you probably wear on like boxing day if you're going to your family where you, you want to look nice but not too dressy I think this could be cute I don't know I've never ever ever tried anything like this before but I'm willing to give it a go 
Okay, I actually really like this dress. I didn't think I would, but I feel like it's such a nice balance between dressy and casual. I don't know if you can see the full length of it. Yeah, there you go, you can see the full length. So it's a nice length, it's not too long, it's not too short. The shoulder pads are nice. I feel like it's a nice, smart, casual thing to wear. It's really flattering. I love it, I love the material, I love the waistband, I love the zip all the way through it. I just don't know if it's me. I do really like it though. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think it looks good or do you think I should send it back? But yeah, that's the end of this haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Let me know if there's any products that you're gonna pick up yourself. Let me know what your favorite was. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new and follow me on Instagram because that's where you're gonna see all the haul, clothing, all the updates on my YouTube because I don't post on YouTube unless I'm posting a video. I know you can do like stories and stuff on here now. Let me know if you'd like to see that. I don't know if that's a better way to like address videos and stuff. But yeah, hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.